Hello Internet, hello YouTube, hello Spencer Studios, hello um, sunny England. Look at that, a rarity. England is sunny and hot. So, a closer look at a painting I just finished. This one is of a vampire, not Edward, not Angel, not Spike, not Bill, not Eric, not Dracula, not um, Blade, not, I'm running out of vampires, uh, Batfink. Uh, we have David from probably one of the first culty vampire things. So here he is, David from Lost Boys. Ready? There he is. Oh, I'm not trying to get far enough back. We have David from Lost Boys on a long, thin canvas with the quote here. You'll never die, but you must feed. That's um, the end of a quote. I think the actual line is something to do with Michael when he's saying, you know what I am and I know what you are or something. Um, but I can't rest. Anyway, so Lost Boys. Lost Boys, they're called Lost Boys because of um, Peter Pan, I believe. So let's have a look at the painting. As you can see, we have a monochrome David, Keith Sutherland, looking out from the black, uh, based on uh, a lot of the promotional stuff, the posters, I think. Um, monochrome face with this like red splatter, which is kind of, you know, kind of blood, kind of just an evilness, I guess, um, which was trying to get, because the posters are all that red and black, the um, of the time, the red and black um, color design on all the posters, so that was trying, trying to um, bring, bring that sort of emotion, that look, I guess, into it. So let's have a closer look, shall we? Let's to make a click. Yep. So here we have the eyes. We have the various layers, as I do. There we go. Black, uh, black, dark grey, grey, white, ending in white. We have the uh, the red, which is sort of a sort of a uh, whiny red. Um, as in wine, the drink, not wine, is it? it complains a lot. Uh, then his spiky mullet, which took a long time. Not too complicated, but when you're trying to you see, it's quite simple. When you look at, it, but when you, it's making those simple shapes, um, making those simple shapes create a full shape. Um, hair is hair is a pain in the ass to paint, really, because you can either overdo it or underdo it. So it's very difficult to get the balance. Um, uh, down to here, we have the evil look, which was. The, you know, the most important thing was getting this this look that Keith Sutherland does in the movie where he's a, you know, a psychopath. And again, into the mouth, just the normal layers. You just put these little flicks out just to sort of signify a bit of stubble um, and a bit more um, movement in the skin. And then you have the quote, like I said. There you go, this quote is painted quite simply. Uh, I'm not sure that's picked up. There's just black and three layers of, two layers, sorry of a, a very light grey and a very, very, very light grey, sort of nearly white. Um, sort of in a, I guess, a gothic writing, calligraphy type writing, but um, I, it was very important to me that when I wrote this, it didn't look like it was done uh, on a computer, so if you look like that E and that E are different. Um, you know, if you type that on a computer, they look exactly the same. I want them to look like they've been handwritten. Um, which they were handwritten by my hand, but you know sometimes the tendency is to make everything perfect. Uh, and then like, like the D is slightly different there. The D there is different to the D there, so it gives it that nice um, scribey look. Um, what else can I say about it? Uh, it's painted in acrylic paint. Um, there we go. Acrylic paint. Galleria Windsor and Newton and various other brands. Uh, on a big thick canvas uh, which is 40 inches by 20 inches so it's quite a big one. Oh that's a good shot you can see his face there so you can see all the detail you can see his frown lines the shadow on his eyes that just the, the hint of his eyeball there the mouth the shadow rolling around getting that nice swerve there and it's like this, this continuous shape which is very cool. Um, I don't know what else I can say about it really. Um, Took about a week to paint, wasn't too bad. Um, when you're working with just one single face, it's not, not too time consuming. Um, the mullet was a bit weird to paint, but the mullet is a weird thing. <laughs> well, I think I can't ramble anymore. I hope you like the video, I hope you like the 
painting um, please subscribe to YouTube my YouTube channel please join my Facebook group if you're over there and um, I have a tumblr if you want to join that and follow me where I just post pictures of paintings half painted and various bits and bobs um, and I have a LinkedIn whatever the F that does if anybody knows what LinkedIn is for let me know because I don't get it um, I'll be back with some more videos soon thank you for watching adios goodbye hasta la vista and remember you'll never die but you must feed. See you later, internet. <laughs>